In this lesson, you'll discover a classical canon of human body proportions, where a head fits eight times into a body's height. For extra precision, I will use the pen and ink medium. The outlines of the body are oversimplified here. One third of the head is equal to the distance from the bottom of the ribcage to the top of the pelvis, which also coincides with the navel level. The same one third is the distance from the hip joints level to the anterior iliac spine at the pelvis. The height of the pelvis is equal to one head. Now I will do a bit more detailed drawing of a male figure. The left part describes its skeletal construction and the right half the muscles of the body. I will draw in two different shapes of sepia ink to differentiate between bones and muscles. The same applies to the back view of the body. Two-thirds of the head is the height of the brain case. It is the distance from the top of the head to the base of the nose. The height of the shoulder blade is the same as the height of the face. One head is the depth of the pelvis region. It is also the depth of the waist. The same measurement is the height of the pelvis. And it is also the length of the radius bone. One head is equal to the height of a male breast. Don't worry if you did not memorize all proportions mentioned here. We will repeat the figure measurements in various videos, so they will sink into your head gradually.